All right, guys, thank you again for, for joining. I apologize again for a little bit of technical difficulty on my part, um, trying to get, trying to learn a new system. We actually did try this, believe it or not, um, multiple times. And then, of course, as the day comes by, it, we, we have new challenges. So, but I think we're good to go. I will say, um, be a little bit patient with us. This is a new system. So some of the switching back and forth is not quite as easy as we were used to. So if we have a little bit of delay there, I apologize in advance. But hopefully we've done enough practice. We can hopefully make this go pretty quickly or pretty pretty smoothly at least um and again again thanks for everybody joining um it's good to see a good crowd again for this um i know this is a an important topic uh as far as what's going on with focus nine i know tipco has done some on this we wanted to kind of take a little bit of different approach just to kind of give you a little bit more of a real world how we're using web focus nine um and, and some of our clients and and our goal always when we work with clients is not just what the technologies are but you know how are we using this to solve real business problems you guys have and hopefully you'll be able to get a flavor of that as you go through it um and, and dinesh will be uh, the main one talking to that we'll deeper into that um as any of you guys who have come before um know this is all the same again the interface being this is a little bit different system may be a little bit new but we do have q a in this as well um so please as you have questions along the way feel free to type those into the q a um, we have, uh, you know, one or two of us here that will be answering those as we go. And if we don't get to them during the time while we're talking, we will get to them at the end. We always reserve some time at the end. So, um, and please raise your hand if you have any problems. We do have it to where we can open up uh, at the end. So if you guys would rather ask us a question um, rather than type, um, you know, let us know. We'll figure that out at the end. But, um, you know, from what we've seen, it's pretty easy to do. Um, we do have, I think, a couple polls in here um, related to one part of it. Um, you guys again have done those, so so really not a, a lot to that. I do I do appreciate the pre precipitation of that. Just help us to kind of guide the conversation. And as always, we do have um, you know more giveaways at the end, and, and look forward to seeing who the winners are. Just for a, a quick agenda, I uh, won't spend any time on this, but just uh, I'm going to go quickly, um, hopefully quickly over just our thoughts on what's coming in 2023, and I call it the not too early. 2023 uh, introduction, but um, all the things that either with web focus related or just generally in the data analytics and data management space that, that we see and are having conversations about, and we'll jump into that in just a second. Dinesh is going to move into more of um, you know how we are building apps with Web Focus 9, give you some kind of some features that we see that are very useful. I'll talk through a number of those as well and, and give you and give you a live walkthrough of an application that we've been working on and show you some of those features in, in real life um, for a project that, that we're working on. And we're not showing the actual project, which is kind of a version of it that we have that we've been kind of doing some more stuff. And again, um, I think I have these backwards. I meant to change this, gift cards. We're gonna do the gift card giveaway after that to make sure that we do that before the top of the hour. So anybody who has to leave um, at the top of the hour, you know, we'll make sure we get that in and then save uh, however long you guys want to stay on Q&A session, uh, stick around and answer questions, we're glad to. For any of those who are not uh, familiar with Amtex uh, and, and don't know much about us, um, uh, we want to do a quick introduction, very quick. We have better things to get to. Um, you can see a lot of numbers there, but we've been doing this for a long time. Um, we've had a long time relationship with information builders that you know turned into a TIPCO relationship after the merger and uh, over 20 years of working with Web Focus and, and some of the other products there, and, and, and of course, a lot of the TIPCO products in the last few years as well, and we've been very excited about that. We're headquarters out of New York, and we have a New Jersey office, and, and then of course, a big office offshore and other places as well, um, that we won't go into. Um, you can see a few of the logos that we work with. We have a number of clients that we work with that we're very proud of, and this is obviously some that you know, our marketing team has put in there, but we are very proud of all the relationships we have, and that's really, truly what drives us. I will say that, you know, our 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 biggest thing is that trusted partnership with our clients and being able to work towards creating real solutions for you guys, not just being a technical resource. Um, as far as TIPCO goes, we do support, and I'm sure if you guys have been around TIPCO very long, you've seen the Connect, Unify, and Predict. That's kind of how they divide their stuff up. Um, we added Cloud there as well, just to kind of talk about you know some of the products that we support um, from the TIPCO stack. And to be honest with you, um, there are a few because there's a lot of products with inside of the TIPCO stack. But the main ones that we work with um, and have been working with are other ones that um, you see here. But we do have others as well. Obviously, WebFocus is one we've worked with for a number of years, Spotfire for 
for other clients as well. Um, and then you, know, you can see some other ones there. But um, and, and again, with, with today's world, you have to be able to support the cloud, whether you're on-prem or not, uh, or in the cloud. The cloud is still a part of most people we work with in some way or another. Um, we have lots of things we offer there we will go into right now. Um, just a quick introduction um, to the speakers. Again, my name is Tim Howard. Um, I've worked uh, at Amtex now for, I think, two or three years, but before that worked for information builders uh, in a number of different capacities um, and, uh, and worked for clients of theirs before that. So I've been in this space for a long time and uh, still really love doing this stuff. It's, <clears throat> it's truly, truly been a huge passion of mine, so very excited about it. Dinesh, uh, as well, heads up our, um, our his VP of analytics, but heads up a lot of our directory and, and general operations for our company as well, and, and has been doing these projects, uh, like me, probably longer than we want to recall, um, and in charge of most of the teams who are doing that, so he's got his, he has a lot of experiences to share from that. Daction, as well, is one of his right-hand um, men, um, working as a project director for a lot of our projects. I know some of you guys that register, I have seen who the attendee list is, but a lot of them registers have worked with Dax on, uh, on a number of his projects. He's gonna be around to help answer some questions in Q&A and just help facilitate some things uh, with, again, his experience as well. Okay, everybody, please give us feedback. We'll be following up with people as well, just to kind of get your thoughts. Any any suggestions you have, any areas that we kind of talked about and brief, briefly kind of brushed over today that you guys want to go in deeper detail, we would love to hear that com the comments on that and, and, and let us know especially if there's things that are you know, relevant to what you guys are doing now. We'd love to hear that information. So, um, but look forward to um, talking again. It probably won't be till the new year. Um, so everybody have a, a great holidays um, you know, over the next month and look forward to uh, continuing our discussions over the next year. Thanks guys, thanks for coming. Thank you all. Thank you.